Okay team, so today is our new promotion for the month. We will be giving out samples of our signature sparkling water and fruit juice that customers can mix together at their own discretion. Erica, you will be in charge of refilling the cups when they get empty. There are bottles of our sparkling water and juice in the back fridge, but do be wary to put them back in the fridge if they are not empty. If the water is out for too long, it can go flat and ruin the taste and quality of the drink. Okay, Ted, don't worry, I won't let you down. As Erica continues to refill them, she starts to feel a little lazy since she's having to do it every 30 minutes. So she takes the satisfying route. She's cutting down the time it has to put the sparkling water back in the fridge by just setting them on the counters next to the window, thinking that this won't affect the taste or quality of the water. Hey Paul, does this taste kind of bad? Yeah, Tom, this doesn't taste all that right. Excuse me, but did I hear you saying that the drinks are not good? Yes, I think the sparkling water is flat or something. We might have to take this up with the manager. Rick notices that Ted is in charge today and tries to confront him about this matter. Ted, the promotion for this month is already turning out bad. The sparkling water is flat and customers are complaining. Can you people do anything right? I'll go take a look at our inventory to make sure there isn't an issue. Ted goes to the back and notices multiple water bottles are open and sitting on the counter next to the window, and he begins to confront Erica. Erica, why are the water sitting on the counter and not in the fridge? We talked about this, and now the promotion is turning customers away. Ted, I'm so sorry. I was just trying to cut down the time I have to speed up on refilling. So that way I can get back to the floor and help out more. I didn't mean to mess up the waters. I truthfully didn't think that it would be a huge deal. I understand. But sometimes taking the easy way out isn't always going to help the situation. We have to fix this. I know just what to do. Erica grabs fresh water and juice and dashes out to the promotions table and quickly refills the drinks and begins to walk around offering the drinks to customers. With satisfaction in their eyes, Erica helped to save their promotion. See, Rick, I told you we could handle this. I'll see you next week, Ted.